Hey guys, and welcome on in for today's video where I'm going to be walking you through the step-by-step -step guide on how to set up your Philips Hue starter kit. So essentially going to be showing you how to hook up your lights, the Philips Hue hub, as well as connecting it to the Philips Hue application. Now beyond this, if you want to set up your Philips Hue lights with Amazon Alexa devices or Google Home, I'm also going to have a couple of separate tutorial videos on how to do just that. And I'll have those particular tutorials linked down in the video video description of this particular video. But the first thing that we're going to want to do is make sure that everything is coming in our starter kit. So the Philips Hue hub, an ethernet cable, the power adapter, the lights that you ordered. And then of course, you're also going to have some instruction manuals. But once you make sure that you have everything that you're supposed to in your Philips Hue starter kit, the first main step here is actually just taking the light bulbs and plugging them in exactly where you want them. So for me, that's going to be up here in my ceiling. I plugged in my two Philips Hue lights that came with my starter kit. And now I'm going to power on the light switch just to make sure that they're working. If they're not working, I definitely recommend returning it and getting some new bulbs because these Philips Hue bulbs can be pretty expensive, even though they do last a very long time. So now the next thing we're going to do is plug in our Philips Hue hub and to do this properly, we're going to take the Ethernet cord that came with this starter kit and plug it into the back of the Philips Hue hub. And then the other end is going to be plugged into the back of our wireless Internet router. And then, of course, we're also going to be plugging in the power source. The other side, of course, being plugged in to your wall so that you're able to power up the Philips Hue hub. It's as simple as that. And now the next step here is going to be setting everything up through the Philips Hue application. And I'm going to be doing this on my smartphone device. So over here on my smartphone, I'm going to be launching the Google Play Store on my Android device. If you have an iPhone, that's going to be the App Store. And you're going to search for Philips Hue in the search bar and then just select the Philips Hue option and click install. Depending on how fast your internet is, this might take a minute or so, or it could be really quick if you have fast internet. But once the Philips Hue application is done downloading and installing, we can open it right here from the installation page, or we can find the little Philips Hue icon on one of the uh, different pages on our smartphone. So we're going to click the Philips Hue application, launch it and get things started here. So it's looking for our Philips Hue hub. And once it finds it, we can click set up. And now we need to click the little button on the top of our Philips Hue hub. And after we do that, then it's going to help us walk through the rest of this initiation phase after we go ahead and check the um, terms of use. And then after that, it's going to have us update our Philips Hue hub. So we're going to go ahead and update it. And that also could take a little bit of time depending on how fast your internet is. We're going to click done once we've finished updating. So now we need to go through and name our first room. And it's a pretty simple process here. We're just going to go ahead. And for me, this is going to be named living room because that's where I put my two Hue light bulbs in. So I'm going to type in living room. And then you can also put a little check mark next to each bulb that you want in the particular room that you're creating. And since both of my light bulbs are in my living room, I'm leaving the check mark on both of them. So then it says, congratulations, everything is up and running. And now at this point, I recommend just working your way through this Philip Hue application and see all the different settings that you can mess around with. You can turn your bulbs on and off. You can change the dim. You can put them on timers and all these sorts of great things. Now, if you want to control the Philips Hue bulbs with your voice through Amazon Alexa or your Google Home smart home devices. I'll have separate tutorial videos on how to do just that. And those tutorial videos will be linked down in the video description if you want to check them out through there. So that's going to wrap up this initial setup tutorial video. Guys, thanks for stopping on in. Consider subscribing for more. And I hope to see you back here for future videos.